know, here's the thing, brother. The neighbors are calling thinking that something's going on. Brother, do us a favor. Try to lower the screaming because from outside it sounds like you're screaming for help. Help me! Help! Someone help! Please, someone help! What's going on, YouTube? Welcome to Fears to Fathom. I'm your host, Farouk, and we're going to be playing this game, Episodic Horror, Fears to Fathom, Woodbury Getaway. So if you guys enjoy this video, make sure to hit that subscribe button and turn on notifications, and let's just get right into it. Fears to Fathom is an episodic psychological horror game where each episode unveils a short story narrated by the ones who survive. You are playing episode five. I did not play episode one, two, three, or four, but f*** it. Let's get right in. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. December 8th. Okay, needed coffee to get done with the day. Okay, it's good. Listen, I got my coffee right here. Phil's coffee. Shout out Phil's. Space to get up. What am I, office worker? Cubicle. They get up. So what did I just do? So I just finished my work or something? I, I had some... This looks like Chicago. This looks like... Uh, Where am I supposed to go? So wait, I just got off work? What happened? Was I was I working overtime or something? Why is there nobody here? Looks like I was putting in some overtime. What is this? Oh, you can open this. Okay, so this is where my coworker Martha works. I did not f*** with Martha. Close that. Close her. Okay. This is the little break room, yes. Need to prepare a cup of coffee. Okay, put a cappuccino in there. I like my coffee black. Where's the cup? Put the cup down. It needed water. Well, of course. Get that in there. Get yourself a little bit of coffee. Make yourself a nice hot cup of joe. I needed to put on a lid. Okay, so where's the lids at? Martha, don't take up all the lids. I'm telling y'all, Martha be taking those lids home. I'm telling y'all, she be taking those lids home. She needs, bro. Drink her a little coffee. So what are we doing? Do Oh, we gotta go to the bathroom? Damn, I gotta pee. Oh, hold up. That's the women's. That's the women's. Don't go in there. Why is the door open? I just closed it. Why did that open? I just closed it. That's some bullshit. Don't start game. Please don't. Hold up. Am I a girl? Oh, I am a girl. Oh, yeah. So I should be going in the women's. Go use the bathroom. Couldn't do it with the door wide open. Well, of course. You need that privacy. Sit down then. We're doing a little tinkle. What is that? What is that? What is that noise? What is that noise? What is that noise? There's somebody in the bathroom. Martha, I know that's your duck. Mm. Oh. Did not scare me at all. I'm so sorry, ma'am. I didn't know you were in here. I will be filing three assault charges on you. That scared the f out of me. I ain't gonna lie. Yes, it's it's okay. I like to clean late because it's pretty quiet at this hour. Yo, get your freaky ass on. He looks like uh Bruce Willis. You working late again, huh? Yeah, you know I gotta keep the bills paid. You young folks sure do put in the hours. Hat. Make sure to take care of yourself. Okay, you too, Bruce. Mm -hmm. They should be having female janitors cleaning the women's bathroom because I know you'll be doing some freak shit in the women's bathroom. I'm gonna let you slide this one time, Bruce. What do I do now? Okay, throw this away. We're done with the coffee. Let Martha clean it up. Somebody's on the phone. Go for Sydney Harper. Hey, Harp, it's Mike. Hey, Mike, how are ya? I've been trying to call yourself for the last two hours. It just keeps going to voicemail. Is everything all right? Yeah, I'm gonna be honest with you. I got that new Samsung LG. That oh, snap. I was starting to think maybe you were ignoring me. Uh, I, I don't like you that much, but no, it even cut out on a client. I'm just kidding. <laughs> um, anyway, uh, what are you still doing at work? It's getting kind of late. You know me, I've been putting in my Damn, hours overtime. Hard. That sounds rough. Good thing I called to cheer you up. Did not cheer me up. You actually ruined my um, mood even more. About our trip, did you get a chance to book the rental house? Just really wanted to see you. And Nora. I'm, I'm be honest with you, I was going to do it after work. Harper, after work. You out. As yeah. long as you book it tonight, I think it'll be fine. Okay, all right. Don't hit my phone again, hey. though. Yep, yeah, yes. I was thinking, since we both live in the city, maybe I could pick you up and ride together. Be nice to catch up. I'm good off that. I appreciate you, though. You know, save on gas and relive the good old days. Just a little bit of Mike and Sydney time before Nora gets there. I ain't gonna lie. Well, the gas is expensive, so... Great. Mm -hmm. Uh, I guess I'll let you get back to work then. Oh, uh, wait. One more thing. When you book the rental, please make sure to keep it under $100 a night. Alright, shut your broke ass up. Nora and I were talking, and she's been on a pretty tight budget. Things haven't been going very well for her hang up hang up on him hang up on him i don't deal with broke people i do not deal with broke people god damn holy sh that's so bright feeling unlucky search internet hello oh wait what oh my god it just typed it for me i didn't type that oh god i didn't type that search search rentacabin.com where are you going no i'm gonna go to woodbury <laughs> he said book it less than a hundred dollars a night they don't got no options other than under a hundred dollars okay here it is 99 should we book it your booking has been confirmed. Okay, print it out. Hey, I'm assuming you get hundreds, if not thousands of stories sent daily. So I'll give you a basic rundown of something that happened to me. I'm sorry if some of it is written weird, but I was rushed. I was in my early 20s. I worked at a big consulting firm in my city. Life at the firm was a constant juggle of deadlines, client meetings, and trying to prove my worth, which didn't leave much room for leisure, let alone a social life. The job paid well, sure, but at the expense of my mental peace. I'm Sydney Harper, and this story takes place during one of those days. One of my college friends, Mike, suggested we take a weekend getaway to rural Vermont. Where the f*** 
Because Vermont, I don't know. Subscribe to the YouTube channel. Which sounded like a perfect break from the cycle of work. Okay. And my other friend Nora was quick to jump on board as well. Okay. So we got Nora, Mike, and Sydney. The plan was simple. We rent a small cabin, close our shift early on Friday, leave, and be back on Monday. Mike came to pick me up two days later. Okay. So Mike just came to pick us up. Now we're now we're at the cabin. Oh. Huh? What's good, my boy? What is that? The new iPad? What is that? The new oh, shit. Michael Carter. Hold on. How do I answer? I just hung up on him. Pulling into the- God damn with this bright ass bro! Pulling into the parking garage now, you down just booked. Okay. Get your- get your bag. Where do we go now? Putting in the you downstairs yet? They gotta go downstairs? Oh, oh, there you are. What's up, Mike? How are you? Harp. Yes, yeah, oh, let's hug him. Hey, how are you, my boy? Damn, you got that new cologne on. Okay. Still how you hug people? Why don't you hug me like you miss me? Just a test hug to see if you smelled first, because I know you'd be stinking. Fair enough, but for the record, I showered for the occasion. Nothing is too good for Sydney Harper. All right, chill out on that glaze, though. Chill out on that glaze. <laughs> Chuckle, long hug. Actually, should we friends on him? Nah, let's let's, let's let's give him a hug. Give him a hug. You look good. So do you, Mike. Or thanks for picking me up. Hmm. Thanks for picking me up. You don't look good. I ain't gonna lie. This weak ass crew neck you got. Thanks for picking me up. Wouldn't have it any way other way. It it'll be nice to have company on the way. This old truck brings back so many memories, though. Right? This bad boy has been through a lot. You can just throw your stuff in the back, and we'll get on our way. Okay, bet. Shit right there. All right then, Harp. You ready to hit the road? Wait, where's Nora though? She'll meet us there. All right then, Harp. Okay, so I'm gonna get shotgun. I call shotgun. There ain't nobody else here, but I call it. Just in case. Just uh, just cause. Why not? Okay. Wow, it's nice. Pretty nice so far. Not not too scary. Harp, isn't it weird? We used to dream about escaping our college, and now here we are, trying to escape from the life we wanted to live. We couldn't wait to get out into the real world. Maybe we just didn't know the, how much the real world world would, you know, suck sometimes. Rick Wilson, new text message. Harp, do you ever miss college? Only the cafeteria food. Holy, I miss those tacos. All right, that's enough. That don't, don't oh, watch out, watch out, watch out. Don't hit the, don't hit the, don't hit the buffalo. That was close. How far is it? Are we even close? Should be about an hour and a half from here. God damn. You know, driving through the snow kind of feels like we're traveling through the intergalactic space. Yo, shut the, yo, bro, yo, bro. What the, yo, what is he chatting about, bro? Look at the way the snowflakes swirl around the headlights. All right, bro, shut that nerd shit up. It's like stars and galaxies rushing past us. Holy yeah, it's kind of beautiful. Oh my God. Okay, bro. All right, all right, all right. I get you. I get you, my boy. You, I like, I get you. That long ass dialogue, bro. Yo, Harp, check that out. What's up? Most pizza. So hungry, I think I could eat a whole pizza myself. Shut your hungry ass up. All right, then, Harp. Operation Pizza Pit Stop is a go. Prepare to land. Hey, what'd y'all get? Y'all got the cheese or what'd y'all get? You got the cheese, huh? Oh, no, you got the veggie. What is that, the white pie? Okay, I see y'all. Evening, folks. Looks like the colds got everyone craving pizza tonight. Hell yeah. You fine folks know what you want to eat? We'll get three slices each. I'll go with the pepperoni, cheese, and the veggie. And for you, miss? Well, I mean, he told me to get the cheese, so obviously I gotta go with the cheese. What's your second slice? Cheese. The third, cheese. All right, then. Six hot slices coming right up. Thank you. That'll be twenty-two fifty. You got it, bro. Oh, snap. I left my wallet in the... Yo, this broke So you tell me I had to deal with all that chatting. I had to deal with all that chatting just for your dumb ass to say I left my wallet in the car. Are you sick? I'm a lady, bro. I'm a female. You should not be treating me like this. All right, bro. I got you, bro. I got you. I got you. Bro. How much is it, bro? 22. All right. Tell me the other half, bro. It smells so good in here. Okay, yeah, it's a pizza shop. It's supposed to smell like cheese and bread. You know what I'm saying? It smells good. Like, obviously. Like... Who sent me a nut? Oh, oh, you guys are going to hate me. I swear, I'll get on the road as soon as I can. But something last minute popped up. I'm not going to bore you with all of the details. The long and short of it is one of my clients needs a last minute change. Okay, I appreciate you. Where's our pizza? Me want pizza. Me hungry. Hungry, hungry, hungry. Did you listen to Nora's voice message in the group? Yeah, I just saw. Looks like she'll be late. That's a bummer. I guess we'll have to start the fun without her. Nah, I'm good off that, but we can wait for her though. Don't act like you don't know what I'm talking about. Okay, hold up, chill out. Order number 27, you folks are right here. Get up and get the- If you don't get up and get the fucking pizza, you gonna make me get it! You gonna make the lady get up and get- Yeah, matter of fact, yes, go grab it. That's a good- See, now that's- That's what a gentleman would do. And you gonna eat first, you ain't even gonna wait for me. What the fuck? He got his own pizza, he didn't get mine, sir. Oh, she's a freak. Ooh, ooh. Damn, Harp, you actually eat the crust? Kind of wasteful not to, I guess. But you wouldn't really eat the peel of an orange, would you? Bro, I've never wanted to smack the shit out of anybody so bad. Hey there, my friends. How are you, sir? Hello. 
I saw y'all pulling driving that nice old truck. That's right. Not to be a bother or anything, but I was heading down the road myself. Seems like we might have been going down the same direction. Y'all mind if I hitch a ride with you? Well, where's your car? Who needs a car when there are fine friends like you to pass the time with? First of all, we don't know you. Don't say friends, my boy. We don't f***ing know you. That's number one. So what do you say? Care to give this free spirit a ride down the snowy road? Nah, nah, nah. I'm not sure. I'm sorry. You gotta be shitting me, lady. No space. I know there's a middle seat. You scared of me or something? Yo, hold the f*** up, really, because what are you trying to get into, my boy? Chill out. You ain't too kind, are you? Unkind people meet unkindness themselves. You best be careful out there. Are you threatening us to see Mike? No, no, y'all got me all wrong. Sorry, I'm just cold and tired is all. What do you want? Guilty conscious make you change your mind? I was just gonna say good luck. Shit on your luck. I should smack the fuck. Oh, that's right. Keep walking. Weak ass backpack. Yeah, it was pretty good, Mo. It was pretty good. I ain't gonna lie, but the cheese is a little bit soggy. You know what I'm saying? But I appreciate you, though. I appreciate you, Mo. It was pretty good. Thanks. Y'all see me out in the driver's seat. 49 p.m. Okay. Oh, we're actually driving. Ooh, watch out! Oh, we missed the turn. Back up, back up. I'm stuck. I'm gone. I'm stuck. The car is stuck! Mike, you just gonna sit there with your big f***ing nose? Yo, help me out, bro! Alright, we're playing with fire. Let me restart the game, chat. Let me just restart the game. Turn right. Watch out! Idiots, you guys, they don't know how to drive here in Woodbury, huh? Park right here. Boom. And this should be it. Okay, thank you. Okay, can you do me a favor and get my bags? Because my bag is killing me. Give just gonna grab the one thing you just gonna grab all right so i'm gonna grab my own bag all right then but you're not a gentleman bro you're not a gentleman you're not getting no cat tonight I'm gonna hold you. open it up get my bag open it up thank you sweet home sweet home throw that shit on the floor all right all right bro come on let's go let's get it for uh, what a great place i knew we could count on you it smells so nice in here right but i really need to hit up hit the john oh sorry about that harp are you okay long drive and all that pizza really did a number on me oh uh, hang on i really need to pee real quick Go ahead, I'll start unpacking our bags, thanks. The smell alone told me the pizza had done a really a number on my- Yo, he Yo, oh, bro! Febreze is free! I want you to know, Febreze is free! It fucking stinks in there, but I'ma go in anyways. Text Rick, text Rick. Okay, hi, we've checked in. We're inside, Rick. Yo, Mike, Mike, Mike! Okay, I hate to admit it, but I didn't wash my hands after being feeling better after the drive. Yeah, yeah, much better now. So, ready to check out the place? Of course, sounds good to me. Okay. So this- Oh my god! Alright, this is that bullshit. So this is that bullshit I was talking about. Oh, hey, you're here. Why the f*** are you on the left side of the door? He's on the other side of the door. Like, bro, what the f*** do you mean, oh, hey, you're here? Get the f*** out of my face, bro. Oopsie daisy, I didn't mean to. Welcome to my home sweet home. What a lovely young couple. No, we're not a couple. We're just friends. Oopsie daisy, silly me. I'll smack the f*** out of you if you say oopsie daisy one more time. You're a grown ass man. We didn't expect anybody to be here though. I was out looking for my cat earlier and I remember the TV has been on the fritz here. Just thought I'd stop by to try to get it working again since the last few folks left a bad word for it. Now that you folks are here, let me show you around my home sweet home. Well, go ahead. Let's do it. Post was a middle-aged man with nervous energy. Here's your shower. That thing will make you feel like you're bathing under a waterfall in the Amazon jungle. This sink doesn't work, unfortunately. Not to worry. I'll get it fixed for you real soon. Look, Harp, this room has a nice ass view. Think that's nice, mister? Wait till I show you the deck. Follow me now, please. It's a nice view, yeah, yeah. Holy smokes, it's incredible. Glad you folks like it. This is one of the, my favorite spots. The creek, view of the creek is beautiful. Great spot for fishing, too. All right, folks, let's head back in before I catch the cold in here again. Here's the storage room. If you need anything, tools, extra blankets, whatnot, it's all in here. All righty, folks, I see you already stocked up the fridge with some tasty food. You see the knob? Turn the knob for more cooling and the knob down to cool it off. I tend to keep it low in the winter. The bill gets out of control. Speaking of winter, I better show you folks the water heater. No, no, no. We don't need to see... Yo, we don't need to see the basement. We're good off this, bro. We don't need to see the basement. We're good. Yeah, you can turn it off. Nothing to worry about down here. Just the water heater and some old storage stuff. Hey, sir, what's the deal with that room over there? Nothing you two need to concern yourselves with. I kind of use this basement as storage. Renters don't need the space. They really ought to keep upstairs. Should I go check out what's in this room? No access to guests. No, he got some freak shit in there. Okay, okay, let's go back up. Let's go back up. Did I mention? Well, no. Maybe I ought to keep it myself. The fella I bought this house from, well, told me his mother died down here. Some guests have reported hearing voices at night, said they could hear something shuffling around down here. Not to scare you folks, but if I were one of you, I really wouldn't step down here. He 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 he? What the f***? Come on now, I'm just joking. Oh, you're just joking. Alrighty folks, snow's starting to pick up. I'm gonna hit the road now. Gotta find that damn cat. Thanks for showing us around. Appreciate you. By the way, what was the name on the booking? I must be getting old. That's not Rick. That's not Rick. This is not Rick.
Is it just me or is that dude super weird? Very weird. Anyway, let's go see if there's anything good on TV. Actually, I'm gonna go take a quick shower. Cool, I'll find something to watch while you're in there. Thanks, see you in a bit. Hey, I don't want to go up to the shower by myself, though. You don't want to come with me? Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, I know you want to... Oh, shit, goddamn, it's just loud. That TV's loud as huh? Alright, I'm gonna go take a shower then. You don't, you don't want to come with me? Ooh, I'm just gonna take a shower real quick. I just want to take a quick shower. The shower door was open. No, it was not. Oh, close it. Yes. Take a quick shower. Take a quick shower. Okay. Now what? Now what? So now what we're gonna do is we're gonna go back downstairs and meet up with our boy, Mike. Hey, Mike, I'm coming back downstairs. Don't be doing no bullshit down there. Yo, Mike, what you got going on? Hey, Harp, check this out. I found this fishing rod in the shed. I don't know. It's cold out there. We shouldn't go fishing right now. I mean, you are tripping. We should go snuggle up under the covers. You know what I'm saying? Come on, Harp. What would make this trip more epic than catching our own freaking dinner? Yo, do me a favor. Order my Uber back home. Yo, do me a favor. Order my Uber back home. Please, bro. I don't fuck. Yo, yo, it's freezing out here, bro. You don't got no, what, like, hand heaters or nothing? Yo, yo, I just want to let you know you got to be one of the lamest dudes I ever went on a date with, by the way. Oh, I got a bite. Got him. Woohoo, just one more carp left. You got this. You gonna let me do all the f***ing work? What was the point of bringing your ass on this trip? No, nah, no, nah, what the f*** was the point of bringing your ass on this trip? You have not done nothing. I gotta carry the bag, the pizza. Drive the car. Got me doing all the f***ing work. Got it. I'm in carp. Keep it. We got it. All right, Harp. Looks like we got three carp. Did you want to head back and throw these in the oven? Let's do it. While I'm cleaning the fish, do you mind prepping the marinade? Just take a bowl, throw in some ginger paste, cooking oil, black pepper, salt, Italian seasoning, paprika, and yogurt. Okay, I got it. Put the marinade. Throw that right there. Matter of fact, throw the heads to mouse. Now, could you add the veggies? All right, it needs to go for 30 minutes at 400. All right, do me a favor. Don't fucking talk. Don't, don't, don't fucking talk to me while I'm while I'm working. All right? Does that fucking itch? Did that go in your head? Did that go in your head? Huh? You saw me. I was about to put the veggies in the shit. Don't. Hit him in the fucking head with it. Pick it up too. Where's the veggies at? What you just gonna put a whole lemon in there? What'd you say? Uh, 300 for 400? There we go. We got it. While we wait for it to cook, how about we play some board games? I saw it. I guess we could. Which one? Just grab whatever catches your eye. Can't wait to see what you pick. I saw some in the room next to the living room. Okay, let me see. You always got me doing everything. You should fucking like, bro. I'm the lady. Like, bro, you got no respect, bro. Like, oh, something in here. A Wheezy board? No, we're not using the Wheezy board. Should we do the Wheezy board? Yes or no? All right, we're doing fucking Wheezy board. Oh my god, I'm scared. Hey, I got the Wheezy board, my boy. Oh snap, is that a Wheezy board? Yeah, it is. Molly once told me how she contacted her dead grandma through one of these boards. Okay, remember how the dude was acting weird about the basement? What if we try to do this down there? You're fucking tripping. Oh, you're fucking tripping. You want to do this in the basement? Remember the guy that said his wife down died down there in the basement? We should use this Wheezy board down there. Let's go. Oh my god! Oh my god! Why? Why? Watch out for spiders down here. Yo, get your dumb ass on, bro. The, what about the food in the upstairs? We got the the carp is finna be done. We don't wanna. You're gonna take me to the darkest corner of the basement. You know what? We'll make this even spookier. This motherfucker. You wanna add on to this? You let me get. You wanna add on to this? Bro? What? Let's turn off all these lights and see if this thing really works. Ooh, I'm getting ready to smack the fuck. Ooh, I'm getting ready to smack the flames out of you. Let's turn off all the. I don't want to. Put it down. Okay. How do you even turn off the lights, bro? Where's it all connected to? Oh, fuck. It's dark as shit. Turn it back on. Mike, I want to go home. I, I don't feel comfortable with you no more. I want to go home. I'm God. Anyways, do you know how this works, Char Harper? No, I actually don't. First, we place our fingers lightly on the planchette. We have to ask the questions to the spirits. If there are any, we'll move this pl the planchette to spell out the answers. One more thing, Harp. Never take your fingers off the planchette until we say goodbye. Otherwise, we might tick off some spirits, she said. All right, then you go first. Let's ask, can they see us? Can you see us? God, that was not me. Okay, I got one too. Go ahead. How's the afterlife treating you, buddy? Does this motherfucker think he's funny? I will really backhand. Don't be disrespectful to the fucking goats. Do not be disrespectful. I don't know what it's saying. Come on, buddy. Give us a sign. Let us know if you're here. What the hell am I doing? Please, 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 there's some freaky shit going on. Yo, let's go, let's go home. Let's go home. My oh, God. The weird part is that you ditched me, you fucking coward. Howell. Yeah, howell. What the hell, Harp? I figured you would move your ass too. I should smack the mic. I've never. Oh my God, Mike. Oh Mike. Would have been nice if you had checked. Have you ever heard of fight or flight? Now that he wants to give me a science lesson. Sydney, I'm sorry. Okay, whatever. Set noise. The food is done. Our show's about to come on. You want to watch TV while we eat? Sure. Honestly, no, you're not even gonna put for me. You just gonna you just gonna put your own food and walk off. You are a dirty. I've never met nobody like you, Mike. I ain't gonna lie. 
This shit do look good though. Ah, uh, yes. The what the fuck kind of freak shit you got on the channel? Blend it into the sauce with a little bit of vinegar. Gotta keep that fancy flavor in there. Is that Berlizzi? That's actually Berlizzi, chat. Yo, this shout out Berlizzi. He follows me on IG. Man. What's up, Berlizzi? Okay, and while that's cooking, we can start on the app. We didn't say goodbye to the Weezy board. Man. We didn't say goodbye to the this Weezy board. Is I need to check my emails real quick. Left my laptop upstairs. So after letting it's the not work. I'm just waiting on a oil. shipment. Details we can put yes, in I'll be right back. Ramen. Berlizzi, shut but that. You sh can use whatever. Berlizzi, shut that shit up, Berlizzi. Don't get me tight. Michael J. Carter, what the? I think there's someone under my bed right now. What the? You come upstairs? Are you f***ing tweaking? What do you mean somebody is under the bed? I'm going home. My Uber is outside. Go upstairs. Go upstairs. See, see. Check it out. Check it out. Check it out. Check it out. Mike, who the f*** is under your bed? What the f*** kind of bullshit? Don't make sounds. Walk slow. Where are you at, though? What bed? What bed? Where? Oh, it's in this room. Oh, my God. Michael? What's going on? Ah! Uh, I don't want to... This motherfucker said, gotcha! I should really grab him by the neck. I should really grab him by the neck and just squeeze that shit into- mm, What the hell, Mike? Why are you doing this? You look at him, break your nose. My good looks are half my charm, Harp. Don't mess them up. You ain't got no good looks, you ugly as shit. That was fun, wasn't it? Yeah, that's not cool. You wanna go for the next round? What the f*** do you mean the next round? Pause. How about a game of hide and seek? No, 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 no. My Uber's outside. Yo, I'm, I ain't gonna lie, bro. Jorge is outside right now with a five-star rating. I'm not, I'm not worried about no f***ing hide and seek. I'm not worried about no hide and seek. I gotta go. I gotta go, bro. All right, you're on, then I'll count to ten. Oh, hide, hide, hide. I decided to hide in the basement. You dumb, you dumb idiot. You dumb idiot. Why the f*** would you go back in the basement? Why the f*** would you go back in the basement? Please, 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 please. Ya Allah, subhanAllah, subhanAllah, bismillah, rahman, rahim. I had to hide under the nook under the stairs. wasn't even a challenge. I figured you'd be good at this since I never find you in the city. Maybe you need to look harder. All right, my turn to hide now. You better close your eyes and start counting. Motherfucker, what are we with 30? I'm a 30 year old grown ass woman. I'm not playing hide and seek with you no more, bruh. Okay, close eyes. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my God. One Mississippi. Two Mississippi. Four, five, eight, nine, ten. Mike. Mike! Mike, I don't want to play no more. I don't want to play no more, Mike. Mike, I don't want to play no more. I don't want to play anymore. It was fun, haha, ha, all games, but I gotta go, seriously. I'm gonna be honest with you. I got a boyfriend. I've been cheating on you. I have not been faithful. I have not been faithful to you! What did Rihanna say? Got you. Come on, Harp. I think I heard something upstairs. No kidding, Sydney. I really heard of something sliding up there. You didn't hear it? No, I did not. I swear on my life I heard something. I see this attic access in the door here. Are you gonna check it out? Why don't you go? I think uh, my shoulders are too broad to fit in there. You got the weakest shoulders? Yo, if you don't get your- Seriously, Sydney, I don't think I would fit through. Where's the step stool? Oh, right here? That? It's a cat. Oh my god, it's a little kitty. Meow. Meow. Oh my god, that's the cat the owner was looking for. You wanna come with me? Come on, let's go. Maybe the owner will give us a discount now that I found you. You're not gonna come? Come. Yes, it's a cat. It's a cat. It was just looks like you aren't the only pussy in the house on God. Say that to him. Say that. Yeah, yeah, that's right. What do you mean by that? It was just a cat. Dickhead. Oh, that's a relief. I was worried there for a minute. I think she was hungry. Oh, yeah, maybe we can give her one of the carp after I come find you again. You still want to play hide and seek? You still want to play hide and seek? Look at your dumb ass. Yo, you need it. You need help. You need help. Go through the bag. Go through the bag. Hide in the school shit. Okay, go in here. Close it. I hear him. He's coming. Wow, you caught me. Wow. I'm getting tired. Look, I'll hide in the house. We're headed back in there anyways. You find me and we'll go to bed. Yo, bro, this is some bullshit, bro. Like, can we just go to sleep? You want to play fucking hide and seek all day? Nobody got time for that bullshit. I got taxes to pay. You're too 
Mississippi 3, Mississippi 4, Mississippi 7, 8, I'm dead, I'm coming. I'm coming, ha, ah, stay where you are, I'm coming. What is that noise? What is that noise? Don't go in the basement. Please don't tell me he's in the basement. Please don't tell me he's in the basement, bro. Uh, you're not in here, here, here. What about the bathroom? What are you in the bathroom? What's going on? What happened? Well, hey there. Why the hell are you back here? What the f*** are you doing with that hammer? Just fixing the faucet. You got a problem with that? I got a problem with you inside my house. You should have told us. Miss, this is my house. I don't need to check in with you every time I fix something. I've never seen anyone fix a faucet with a hammer before. You ever fix many faucets yourself, young man? Didn't think so. So I'd imagine you don't need, you don't know what tools you'd need. How long have you been for? Just got here a couple minutes ago. If you heard anything before that, it must have been that old lady, remember? Yo, you're not funny, bro. You're not funny. By the way, you're, you're balding. I want you to know your hairline is pushed back. Look, we need to go to bed now. Do you think you can fix it tomorrow? You asking me to leave, miss? No, Rick, she's being polite. We rented this house. We would like it to ourselves. I, we don't really want to call law enforcement. Ain't no cops in Woodbury, son. The f kind of shit is that? Think they're gonna arrest a homeowner for fixing a faucet? I was just doing some work. If you can't handle that, it's your problem, not mine. You know what? If you folks don't like me fixing a faucet, I'll leave you to it. Don't call me if it starts leaking again. Get the f out of my house. I should smack the fuck. Get, yo, and by the way, your dirty ass cat is in the attic. I want you to know. What happened? Oh. I think that's a checkpoint. After locking the door, we debated what to do. We agreed that there was something off about Rick from the start. It seemed like he enjoyed making excuses to come over unannounced. In the end, we decided Rick was weird, but probably harmless. We attributed his behavior to an extreme lack of social awareness. Look, we already drove all the way out here. Let's just enjoy ourselves, Mike said. But by this time, I was feeling really tired. I decided to get some rest. Somebody's at my door. Yes, 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 yes. Why do you look yes? Harp, you still awake? Hard to sleep when someone's knocking on the door. You mind if I come in? I'd like to talk about something. Motherfucker, I'm tired, bro. What? What is it? What the fuck? Why are you? First of all, why are you posted up like this? The storm's starting to get really bad. I hardly, I can hardly see the truck in the driveway. Yeah, it's gotten pretty bad. What a day, huh? This, is, this wasn't exactly how I thought our getaway was going to go, Sydney. It's been a strange day. Can you believe that guy? He just keeps wandering around the house like he owns the place. He does own the place, but I wish he would just cut it out. Yeah. I thought you may be scared in here by yourself. I mean, I am a little freaked out. Why don't you come sit by me, Sydney? The f are you looking at me like that for? What do you want, Harp? You know. What do you want? I've missed this. First of all, you know we're just friends, right? Us, just talking. It's been too long. You know, you don't have to sleep alone tonight if you don't want to. I'm gonna be honest with you, I would much rather sleep alone, okay? Just looking at your face makes my stomach turn. I'm just being honest, okay? I did not want to come here in the first place. You told me it'd be a free vacation. You, 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 you ended up asking me for half the bills and shit. Mike, where's this coming from, though? You act like you don't remember our trip to Oregon. I remember it being pretty awkward. Didn't start out awkward though. Mike, we had a lot to drink. Things happened. You know what I'm saying? You you, you slipped it in. Huh? Yeah, but it, <laughs> like I'm saying, that was, that was, I had a little bit of tequila. You know what I'm saying? It's all. They sure did. I'm hoping again. I'm hoping maybe they can happen again. What, what happened? Who texted us? SOS, please. Guys, I think I'm about 70 miles away from Woodbury and my stinking tire just blew out. It's snowing and I'm on the side of the road on Highway 11 near Killington. Can you two come get me? What a timing, huh? But I guess we can't leave Nora stranded. Let me get dressed. I'll meet you downstairs. No, Sydney. You stay here and get some sleep. There's no sense in both of us freezing our ass off. Are you sure? Yeah, I'm sure. You're in pajamas and I'm so dressed. You just settle in and I'll go help Nora. No, 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 no. He's gonna leave me here alone? Oh, don't leave me here alone, though, my boy. Don't leave me here alone. No, 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 no. Not alone. Don't leave me alone. Please. Hey, why don't you get some rest while I'm gone? Before I go, how about a hug? No, not now, Mike. Not now. Okay, listen, you drive safe. You drive safe. I'm gonna get some sleep, all right? I'm a, okay. Bring your back, though. You Don't be gone for too long, because it's a little scary to EMS in the basement. You remember the Ouija board? You remember the Ouija board or not? Okay, it's a little scary, so just come back a little quick, all right? I appreciate you. Watch out. Your, your headlights are on. I was about to say off, but they're on, actually, so you're good. <clears throat> you're good. What happened? Why is he not letting me go to sleep? What's happening? Thank you, bro. Let me sleep. Let it be morning already. Please let it be morning time. I told myself things would get better if I just get some rest. Nora always knew how to cheer me up. Okay, 12.39 a.m. Oh, are they here? Are they here? That's either them or my DoorDash. I'm, 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 I'm happy either way. Who is it? Yes! I saw you there, my friend. Please open the door. I'm freezing to death out here. No, no, no. There's nobody here. Nobody home, sir. You mother... Don't bang on my door. Sir, don't bang on my door. I'm gonna call the cops. This is an open carry state. I'm, I, I'm gonna start blasting in a minute if you don't watch out. I'm not opening this door. Watch out. Ah! Who is it? Hey! What the f*** do you want? Get out! Get the f*** away from the house! I saw you there, my friend. Please open the door. I'm freezing. I'm not. I'm not. I'm sorry. I gotta- It's a- It's a- uh, It's- It's full. It's full! The house is full. There's no room. That's the guy from the pizza shop. No, I'm not opening the door for you. I'm going back to bed. Someone was at the front door. Obviously. 
fucking Lee, you don't gotta answer him, bro. He's not gonna fucking stop knocking. Please go, please go away. Please, on God, go away. On God, go away. Please, please, I'm begging you. I'm begging you. Hello? Look, friend, I know it ain't ideal banging on your door in the middle of the night, but I'm in a bad spot here. I was counting on a ride from some friends, but they're running behind and won't be here for about two more hours. You can sit on the porch while you wait. Thanks, but I was hoping you'd let me wait inside until my friends get me. You're not coming in. End of story. Are you fucking kidding me? Hold up. Who the f you getting loud with? Who the with. You're gonna let me freeze to death out here? I didn't make you go hiking out in a snowstorm, dumbass. I should have known you'd be a. <laughs> I should have known you'd be as big a here as you were back at the pizza joint. Think I didn't see you and your little boyfriend flashing in the creek earlier? I figured maybe you'd give me a chance this time, but looks like you're still unkind. Get out or I'll call the cops with your old ass. Ain't no cops around here. Speaking of, I don't see your fellow's truck out here either. No, no, it's, it's parked in the back. Suit yourself. But let me tell you something. You'll get what's coming to you for leaving me out here. Karma's a bitch, my friend. Get the f out of my front porch. I don't give a f about you or Karma. Now what? Now what do I do? Do I go to bed? Go back to sleep. I couldn't keep my eyes open. I had to get some sleep. What the f is that? What the f is that? Text Rick. Rick, I'm sorry to bother you, but can you come back over there? Someone banging down here started threatening me. Can you please come since you live so close? What's in, what's going on in my house? This is an open carry state. I don't, I don't, whoever the f is in here, this is an open carry state. I'm gonna start blasting. I'm gonna get you blasted in a minute. Who the f is in my house? I don't ask no questions. Questions last. What's that? What's that? Rick, Rick, Rick! Yes, Rick, please! Rick! Open the door! Rick! I can't believe you're here! Thank okay, God, I'm so glad you came. Uh, so there's this guy, he was here, he was, he was, he's acting all crazy, Rick. Yeah, I came as quickly as I could. I wouldn't worry about him anymore. Why? What'd you do to him? By the way, where's your friend, the guy that was with you earlier? Mike, he went back to pick up our other friend. So you're all alone here right now, huh? What the f are you looking at me with that? Yes, I'm all alone, bruh. Yeah, but my friends are gonna be back soon, though, so like... Storms like this bring out all kinds of folks. Not all of them know when to stay away. Yeah, I mean, I, I guess. I mean, I don't, I'm not really from the area, but. Come back over? What do you mean? I live in Britain. That's not Rick! 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 What the fuck is that? What the fuck is that? Who are you texting? Who are you talking to? I was texting my friends. They're almost here. Is that so? Yeah, thanks for coming by, though. You can head back if you want. You sure about that? Maybe I should stick around and make sure everything's really okay. Who are you? What did you just say? This is my f***ing house. I will leave when I want to. You need to leave right now before I call the cops? Get out of here before I call the f***ing cops! I don't think so. Okay, my fault. I'll leave then. My fault. Let's act like this never happened. I'll leave. If anyone is leaving this house... One of us. Oh! What are you doing? What are you doing? What the f are you doing? What are you doing? What are you doing? What are you doing? What are you I'm supposed to hide? I was supposed to hide? I was like, I was wondering what he was doing. I was, I was confused. Okay, go back, go back, go back, go back, go back, go back, go back. I thought he was doing. So I thought I had to like go up from behind and 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 you know what I'm saying? Like stop him or like you run basement then upstairs then the attic. Go, go, basement! Okay. Ah. What happened? I accidentally tapped my mic. The stairs are see-through? No, no, that's a good, that's a good, that's a good hiding spot. Run, 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 run!
Was I supposed to run out? Was I supposed to run out? The audio. You hear the game audio. Grab the tool before you go down. There's a fucking lunatic here. He looks like Bruce Willis from the movie Die Hard. I think it was released in 2012. I might be mistaken. Shut the fuck up. Who's in the- Where do we go now? Window? Help me! Help! Someone help, please! Someone help! Someone please! Flash the lights. Flash the lights. Signal, signal for help. Morse code. I need help now, please! Is that Morse code? How do you go down? You gotta go down? Oh my god. Man. Ban whoever told me to get out. Ban whoever told me to get out. Ban whoever told me to go down. Enrichments ban him. Enrichments ban him. Mm. Yes, sir. Yeah, yeah, I'm good. I'm good. No, it's somebody screaming. No, I'm it, I'm playing a horror game. I'm streaming it. Yeah, yeah, I'm playing a, playing a horror game. Oh, here's the thing, brother. The neighbors are calling thinking that something's going on. We hear you screaming. The neighbors here, so we think there's an emergency going on in the house right now. Right. Yeah. I understand. I understand. On yeah, I'm on Twitch right now. I'm on Twitch. Faruqi. I'm actually live right now if you guys want to come. No, no? All right. All good. All right. All right. Faruqi. Faruqi. Yes, sir. Right. Brother, do us a favor. Try to lower the screaming. Okay. Because from outside, it sounds like you're fighting. There's an emergency going on. No, out. I got you. I will. It sounds like you're screaming for help. I got you. That's why we're here. No, I appreciate that. Thank you so much. I'm sorry. All right. I was, brother, I was thank live. You. Well, law, that was not a clip farm, I swear to God. Bro, there was noise outside my room. I thought I was tripping. I'm like, what the fuck is going on? Three police officers got their flashlights like this. What's going on? They actually thought I was like, bro, what the fuck? The neighbors, the neighbors, bro, the neighbors, I swear to God, the neighbors complained. Should I continue? I'm gonna, I'm gonna have to be very quiet now. That's actually crazy. What do I do now? What do I do now? Bro, let me explain something to y'all. Four officers j were just outside my room right now. Literally four. I, I literally, when I came outside right now, the living room, there were four officers. I'm a TikToker that streams Valorant. They got four, they got a whole SWAT team out here for me. It's fucking crazy, bro. Hey, lock in again. What do I do? I'm waiting? Are you all right? Just got done talking to the other guests on the phone. I've called 911. Okay, yeah, now do I go down? They're back. Do I go downstairs? He ran out the back door. Oh my god. He ran out the back door. He ran out the back door. On our drive back, the whole night played over and in my head. We thought that man secretly lived in the cabin when it wasn't being used, planned on robbing us. But cops seemed there was more intent. Rick asked me what the man looked like. We think he knew more than we was letting on, but in the end, he gave us a full refund. So the moral of the story is never use Airbnb. Is that the end of the game? Survive through the fifth episode. Okay. All right, YouTube, thank you guys so much for watching. Yes, those were actually the cops that were actually just in my room. I swear to God, that was not a clip farm. Well, lohi, that was not a clip farm. Uh, but if you like this video, make sure to please hit that subscribe button. And make sure to turn on notifications so that you're reminded whenever I post in the future. I don't really have a set schedule, so you better turn off the, turn on, turn on the notifications.